The seventh grade math department at Shadow Lawn Middle is unlike any other. Amy Garner, Jennifer Powell, and Amy Spate form a teaching team that has gone above and beyond the call of duty. Their teamwork through the use of professional learning communities has caused the department to thrive. The thing is that all three of them are exceptionally strong teachers. All three of them with very different styles. Miss Spate has very organized lesson plans and makes sure that all of her students adhere to the objectives. Miss Spade is extremely organized and, and very uh, much uh, rigorous with her students and demands excellence of them. Miss Spade, she is super organized and very efficient. She taught very well and it seemed like she knew what she was talking about and she just went over things very clearly. Miss Garner brings a creative touch by intertwining games and movement in the classroom. So whereas you have Miss Spade who is um, more analytical, you have Miss Garner who um, kind of balances that out with the whimsical and it really creates an interesting environment for our students. Always redoing things, always making sure, um, like I said, that the kids are on, on top of what the objective is. It really didn't even feel like a math class anymore. It just feel like family. Ms. Powell helps tie the bunch together with lesson plans incorporating different types of technology. She brings a real sense of uh, how to work with individual student differences. She's just a very um, fun, enthusiastic, and just comes to work every day um, excited to be here. She is really tech savvy. She uses a lot of technology in her classroom. All of these teachers' outstanding qualities have proven instrumental in their teamwork. I jokingly say, if you put all three of us together, we're a pretty good teacher because we really are all three different, but we come together. Two years ago, teachers at Shadow Lawn began using professional learning communities. Teachers of the same um, subject area come together, ideally weekly, to discuss best practices. We all draw on each other's strengths. You can't just shut your door and not worry about what your fellow teacher is doing anymore because we're all in this together and we all are trying to get the entire school to succeed. This trio has taken their PLC meetings to the next level. A couple years ago when we were a little unhappy with our scores that, hey, something's got to change. We PLC at lunch in the morning, in between classes. A typical PLC for us is anytime you see the three of us together, we're constantly talking about math. It's contagious being around those guys. So you're like, oh yeah, how are we going to do it? These teachers have worked together to devise interesting and effective lesson plans, and that is apparent in their students' test scores. They were nearly the highest middle school growth scores and tripled in the second year. Test scores don't lie, and I, I, I truly believe that the collaboration is made all the difference. Ms. Gardner, Ms. Powell, and Ms. Spate's diligent collaboration has made them models for other teaching teams and most importantly, their students. You see me smile because I love what I do, but working with these girls, it's just, it makes it a lot more um, interesting, a lot more fun and I think the kids see how well we work together and we pull for each other all the time. For Shelby County Schools Report, I'm Emily Wolf.